Hello Lola's, welcome back to my channel guys. Guys, I'm here with Baby Aspen and we're gonna get him dressed. I normally don't do the, um, I normally don't do like holidays as much and stuff, but I saw this cute little outfit and I was like, oh, and I thought I would get it. It looks a little big though. I'm trying to see, oh, it does say zero to three months. I don't know. I don't know. It says Mommy's Lucky's Charm. But, yeah, this looks big. Oh, well, we're going to see what, see if he can fit it. If not, I'll have to put him on something else. Because, and this still defeats the purpose. I just thought about it. I really wanted to put him on long sleeves today. Oh, well, let's see. Dang it. I didn't even think about that. I wanted long sleeve, and these look too big. Mm, I don't know that I have anything right here that he could put on. I just have a um, another sleeper. Anyway, let's see. We'll see what happens. But yeah, th that zero to three month look like it's way big. I know the hat is huge, but I don't know. I can't send it home with any of the babies because if I send it home with one of my other babies, St. Patrick's Day will be done past. Mm. I don't know. Well, listen. And for those that didn't know, um, Aspen is the prototype for by <laughs> He's the prototype Aspen sculpted by Claire Taylor, painted by me. This pacifier, I just clipped the nipple. And also this pacifier came from my friend Stacy from um, Gianna's Baby World Reborn. So, thank you. I, um, I'm just now finally using it. Like I said before, I will use stuff late, but I will use it. Why you got like little fuzzies in here? All right, so I am so perplexed about what to put him on now at this point. Um. Oh well, let's just go for it and see what happens. So I'm probably blocking the light for him. Let me see what you guys can see. Oh my gosh. It just gets so, I get so, um, so flustered when I, I've realized that it's something that I don't want. Okay, so I got something for you guys, something to tell you guys. Um, lesson learned. And I did this before on a blanket. Um, some of us use like baby powder fragrances and stuff like that scents that we spray on the baby clothes sometimes we spray it on their cloth body you know some people use the wafers i wanted him to smell like baby so i sprayed his diaper and thank god that that's all i sprayed and i was very careful to make sure i didn't get it on his body and um i'm going to show you guys what it did some stuff we don't realize leave stains let's see there we go all right look at this i don't know oh, hang on let me see let me see if make sure i can see what you guys can see it's a like a brownish looking stain right here You guys might can't see it, but it's a it looks kind of like a dirty looking stain. And I'll, I'm telling you this because you can ruin clothes. And now that I think about it, I sprayed it on Phoenix shirt, but it didn't leave a stain there. But it definitely left a stain on this diaper. Oh, but the diaper smells so good, y'all. Which, you know, you won't care about the diaper, but I'm just saying... Just make sure you're not spraying this stuff on your baby's bodies and 
you know, stuff like that because you just don't want to stain them up. Now, I pretty much keep his tummy plate on him because it's like one of these tummy plates. And so, gender neutral is not anatomically correct or anything. And it, you know, it doesn't get in the way um, of his cuddle factor. So, I love when I fold his little legs up. It's funny, like, you know... You never really can tell what the babies really look like until you actually see them in person. They always tend to um, have a little different look <laughs> in person. And I just, I, I don't know. It's something about him I love. Like, someone said something like, with his pacifier, he looks so calm. He has moments, but he does look like a baby that if you bother him while he's sleeping, he's going to get fussy. Or if you um, or he's about to he's he's about to wake up like he's stirring in his sleep. That's the kind of expression to me he has. And um so, I love it. I'd be wanting to put his pacifier on because he looked cute with his pacifier, but then I hate to cover up his little lips. I hate to cover up my little lips. I'm so sweet. And I'm so, I'm so glad my rooter did such an amazing job. Um, Sentimental Babies. She, um, she always used the most high quality hair for my babies. Well, we kind of picked the hair out anyway. The colors. I mean, we've been working together for um, a few years now. She's been rooting dolls for me, providing that service. And some babies, normally I don't be too specific, but um, like prototype babies and stuff, I be very specific. And... Um, we try so hard to get it right. It's so funny. We be so funny. Um, but she's like, we work so well together. But her work is phenomenal. And I can't be more thankful that she is still continuing to root for other people. Because she does, you know, paint and stuff herself. And do her own, you know, her own work. And stuff like that. Look at you. I know it's going to be a little big, but that's okay. Newborns don't usually fit their clothes to a T. But, yeah. Um, I remember when I first showed him. And I know you probably guys probably tired of me sticking his little hands up. But I just feel like babies never really have their hands completely down all the time. A lot of times, sometimes they do. But for the most part, they got him sticking out or doing something. And the way that his arms are sculpted, I just like them up. I don't know. When they up, then they up, then they up, then they up. <laughs> um, but yeah, and I got this little, I got this outfit for $7.99. That's one of my favorite stores to shop when I'm not shopping Carter's or uh, H&M is Ross because you can get a variety of different brands from that one stop. So I usually go there for my blankets and I usually go there for different clothes because I can get all different brands from that store. And it's convenient, it's right right uh, by a Carter. So when they don't have, I can go to Carter's. Um, but, you know, with the amount of babies that I have, and then when I'm sending babies out, that money adds up. I just want to make sure he's warm today since I have to leave him. I just want to make sure that, you know, with the AC on, the air on, that he doesn't get cold. Because Papa is not going to know to monitor him as far as if he's cold or not. 
Say, say my, my daddy don't pay attention, do he? He not gonna pay attention. Truth be told, I'm gonna have to send a nanny. Cause Papa ain't even gonna come in the nursery. All right. So I don't know if I should put him on the hat. Let me see what you guys can see. So, like, so th from this angle, let's see. We go this. I go this. Maybe I should turn him this way. I'm gonna turn him this way too, so you guys can see him from this side. So, and from that way. <laughs> you on the spinning wheel, Aspen? Look. Let me see what y'all see. <laughs> this video finna be over. All right. Let me get him back. Come on. <laughs> All right. So, like I said, let me see if. Let me see how he does with his hat. Which I know is too big. My alarm is going off. I mean, I got to get going. I'm gonna mess up his hair. But yeah. <laughs> That's him with his little hat on. I don't like him with this hat on. Ooh, baby. Now you got hat hair. His hair is kind of wild anyway. But it's all good. Anyway, so that's him. And again, thank you guys for watching. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to put on his socks. But this is hands, by the way. His hands are open. Sorry, I never showed his hands. So hands are open in different little positions. Sometimes he can he can suck his thumb. So sometimes I let him suck his thumb. I may leave his little mitts off so he can suck his thumb. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna put him on his socks. So that's that. I'm probably gonna give his socks to his brother laying over there. I'm gonna leave these mitts right here. And I'm going to put away the rest of his stuff. Because I'm trying to keep this place in order. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and share this video. Good night.